What is going on, everybody? I'm your boy, Retro Bliss, and this is Retro Bliss Gaming. I hope everybody's having a good day today. It is Tuesday, October 24th. <clears throat> We're going to have some fun today. We're going to reveal, reveal the winners of the Retro Bliss Gaming Ninja Contest for last week. We played, what did we play? Junior Pac-Man and Mega Mania, the Atari 2600 games, and... Um, before we do that, I want to, want to tell you guys what games we have on tap for uh, this week. We want you guys to play Donkey Kong and Beam Rider. Uh, you have until October 30th to get those game scores to me at RetroBlissGaming at gmail.com. Uh, get your high scores, have proof of date within the picture. You'll see here in a minute because I'm going to be displaying some uh, pictures here in a minute. But um, we have a lot of fun here on the channel, and I'm going to have some fun today because we had a lot of uh, participation this week. I'm really excited about that. So um, anyway, um, you'll see here in a minute what it's all about. So uh, before we do that, I have something else here I was really excited about. I found out. Um, we've, we've been doing the channel, um, a little less than two years in, um, uh, well, it's been in November, it'll be about, um, two years that we've been consistently doing the channel and, uh, we started out slow and, uh, but anyway, long story short, it's been a little bit of a roller coaster, but with your help, we've had a lot of uh, success on the channel, and uh, we got a little uh, notification here from vidIQ, and we've uh, hit 175,000 views. And so uh, I want to thank you guys for that. And so uh, that's kind of an exciting uh, milestone for the channel. So I thought I'd share that with you guys. So anyway, let's get to some uh, scores for the games that we played this week. And the games that we played this week were um, Junior Pac-Man and Mega Mania. All right. So let's get to the scores. So I'm going to go with the lowest scores first. Let me see which ones I want to do here because I had, <laughs> I had a funny score uh, participation. My buddy CDB, I think I'm going to give him a different nick, 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 nickname. <clears throat> I'm going to start calling him Mr. Baseman. He's on the channel as CDB. You guys see him there, but I'm going to start calling him Mr. Baseman. <laughs> Please forgive me. I am really dealing with these allergies, and I'm sucking on a cough drop to try to keep from coughing. But he submitted a score for Junior Pac-Man. And I think he did this for two reasons. Just to submit a score just in case someone else didn't. And to, and to show that this is a tough game. Because it is a tough game. But uh, <clears throat> let me see if I can get to it here. This was CDB's score for Junior Pac-Man, okay? Everybody ready? 30. <laughs> All right, that didn't quite cut it, Mr. Baseman. Not today, bro. <laughs> Hey, Magnus. Yeah, um, actually, um, uh, he's talking about Zookeeper. <clears throat> we'll get to Zookeeper in a minute, but um, I purchased Zookeeper from the Atari H store before they shut down, and I still haven't gotten it. And um, I know John Champo, and uh, every time I purchase a game from, um, every time I have purchased a game from Atari Age, I have all of his games but Avalanche. Um, and then two new ones. I'm waiting for those to be available. I'm going to be getting those soon here. But anyway, long and short of it is, um, 
Every time I do, I purchase the ROM versions, and uh, I hadn't uh, gotten around to purchasing them for, from John. And so I contacted John over the weekend and bought it, and so he sent it to me by email. And so I decided to play it. So I have the full ROM version here, and so that's why we're playing it today. So anyway, get to the next one. And uh, the, next, the next highest score was from Mr. Chickens. So this is from Mr. Chickens. And uh, this was a very respectable 12,960. And this is a tough game, guys. I know it is. <clears throat> very tough game, Junior Pac-Man. So uh, very good score, but um, you didn't quite do it, my brother. <laughs> so uh, <laughs> I think I think Mr. Baseman's a little, uh, little disappointed he didn't win at 30 <laughs> all right so uh we have one more one more score and this this guy just knocked it out of the park and this is my brother from another mother right here this was uh operation shutdown Thirty six thousand six hundred and thirty. that is crazy well, you won again, man. That's your second one. So, all right. Um, you'll be getting you'll be getting two in, at one time, man. Because I actually I wanted to show you guys something. I have been battling sickness. I've been dealing with my parents. Um, I had a problem. I want to show you something. I had a um, um. I'm not trying to get sympathy or anything. Um, I was. I bought a recumbent bike so I could start doing some exercise at home, and I went to go pull it out of my my uh, Pi Honda Pilot. And when I did, I did something to my bicep. I don't know if you can see it. It's like I pulled my my bicep. Something popped, and I have no strength in it at all, and it hurts like the Dickens, and it bruised. I I, I don't know if I like dislocated pulled it pulled the muscle away or toward or something i don't know what i did but anyway i haven't got a chance to get them all together i was and so since i was kind of late to the party i thought well i'll wait until the winners of today and then i'll get them all together so you guys will be getting them and i do apologize i, I am so so sorry but anyway so operation shutdown you won junior pac-man congratulations so let's get to mega mania all right so Let's see. I had to get them together. So we had some more, a little bit more participation with uh, Mega Mania. So. This. This next score for Mega Mania actually was from Operation Shutdown. He actually had the lowest score for Mega Mania, believe it or not. Um, he had 27,340, which, which actually is really good. That's a good score, man. So, anyway, uh, really good, man. But that wasn't good enough for for today, man. Because we we had some really really good participation and good scores, and that didn't quite do it. So, anyway, the next high score was from Mister Chickens, and he had thirty four thousand seventy, and that was really good, but that wasn't good enough. So, the next one was from Mr. Baseman, and you can't see it, but it's um, 46,240. It's really hard to see in the picture. I like, I like the way he plays. He plays on old school CRT television, and uh, that's, that's, that's the way to do it, man. That's the way to play these games. But anyway, uh, he didn't get it either. At that, if that's hard to believe, but uh, Brian, <laughs> Brian, thanks for coming by, buddy. Um, he didn't get it, so we had a new participant this week, and he won. His name is Will Platts. Look at that, fifty-eight thousand two hundred and sixty. So, Will, congratulations! You are the Retro Bliss Ninja. For Mega Mania. So, Will, get your address to me, man. You are the winner. 
So uh, get your email me. You have my email address. Email me your address, and I will get your Retro Bliss Ninja card to to you as soon as possible. So congratulations to you. So um, all right, with that, let's get to some Zookeeper. That's what you guys are here for. And um, so let me get to getting here. I have to do a little. Um, when I stream, I have, I have right here in front of me, you guys can't see, but I have like three monitors and on my, my right is the stream set up in my in front of me is where I play the game. And on my left is where I do the chat and I can see what's going on with the stream on uh, YouTube. So I got all this stuff going on and I have to kind of monitor one, one from the other, from the other, from the other. And so <clears throat> it takes some time. So, Hey, <laughs> Mike from Mike's game and gallows here. Cannabis showed up. Hey, John Champo just showed up. Hey, John, we were talking about you, man. Uh, yep. I, as he he knows, I just got the game, so we decided to play play it. I've dem I played the demo on the channel before, but I decided to play the full ROM version. So that's what we're gonna do. I ordered the game from uh, Atari Age during the last chance uh, sale, but uh, as you all know, he had uh, Al has like a thousand orders to do, so I don't expect to get them anytime soon. So we're gonna play what we got. Let's go. This is an amazing game, man. I never played the arcade game, so this is kind of all new to me. And I'm I'm I don't play for if you're looking for expert gameplay, you kind of came to the wrong place, but we just do it because we have fun. So the graphics are amazing for this game. It's amazing what John has done for the 2600. Oh, this is the part I'm not good at. Oh, dog. Oh! I'm never good at this. Dirty dogs. Bye. 
Hulk! Oh! My scores, I'm not doing too good this game. Oh, I meant to jump. Dog on it. was not good this this is on my second time playing the game since I bought it <laughs> ah. all right let's go let's not continue I wanna I wanna I wanna I want to just go from the beginning. For you idiot. This takes practice. Get out. CDB changed his name. All right, cool.
<sighs> All right. Well, let's just go with it. Nope, we're not gonna continue. Doggone it. That's the only problem with John Champo's games. He programs them to cheat. Oh! Doggone it. Man, what am I doing? I was up there. Oh, I shouldn't have, I should have seen it. Doggone it. Well, that was bad. No, I'm not gonna continue. I was kidding, John. <laughs> All right, let's go. got out. Oh! Oh! Got out!
I want to go back. Oh. I think the best way to do is just kind of follow the animals because What am I supposed to do here? <laughs> I didn't know what I was supposed to do there. I didn't know what I was supposed to do there. Oh, John says I don't get any points. I have to I have to take risks and jump the animals to get points. Okay. That's no fun. You had too many coming out at me, John. <laughs> All right. Well, if I continue here, let's see what happens. Oh, I hit no, idiot. Okay. Doggone it. I thought I was playing Amoeba Jump there for a minute. Doggone it. I can't control. get too many points did I oh 
No, I want to go down. I saw it there. Doggone it, I saw it there. I love the high score saves. I love that. dogs. I can't touch the... I have to jump over that. I jump over it. I can't hit it. Oh, dear Lord. jump For some reason in my mind, I still thought I had that. <laughs> John Shampoo, the moose is on the loose. to him like an idiot.
I hit jump. No, people. Man, I thought I hit jump. I didn't hit. I'm not hitting jump in time. Doggone it. I think my continues are over, too. Oh, they have lines in the next one. John says it's even more difficult. <laughs> All right, let's continue on. You guys know we play for an hour, so I'm not done yet. I'm going to put this ROM on my Harmony card. I can't wait to play it on the... CRT, see how it looks. I thought I hit... How did that happen? I had the thing... I had run over the thing. do a rage reset on this one come back here Come on! The longer I wait, the more those things are out. Dang it! continue on that game let's go rage reset
almost got hit that time. How come I can't do that any other time? Slack jaw booger eating, farting, tooting, crack smoking, whoremong, and hillbillies. Didn't do very well that round. Oh, I jump. No, people. Dang it. I don't get to, I didn't get to, no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm getting it, John. I'm getting it. That's the fun of these games. You know, you learn, you play, you get, you, you play, you get better. You know, you just, you just keep going. You keep going. You keep going. You get better, you know? <clears throat> Joel is in the house. I've got to get props to Joel. Joel was one of my interviews. Um, um, 
in my thousand uh, subscriber episode also. I think him and John were in the same episode. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Joel was my uh, one of my very first subscribers. He was at least the first one to ever comment on any one of my videos back in the day. So uh, we're going to continue. I want to continue see... came out on me oh man man my reflexes are not very good yes we're gonna continue So what's going on? There, yeah, I got it. Oh, I wanted to jump. No, people. to get the thing. I didn't think I was near it. I keep forgetting you can go from the other side.
I thought I hit jump, I wasn't down. I hit jump, but I wasn't on the ground when I hit jump. Oh! No, people! I didn't see the stupid... No. Mr. Baseman's talking about he has kicks coming. Man, kicks is one of my favorite games for um John has so many though. Ro Robot War 2684 is probably my all-time favorite. Uh I actually have a um video that's going to be coming out here in the next 3 or 4 weeks of um Oh, a second. <laughs> We're going to continue. Yes. Oh, I hit I hit a button. I won't be. Anyway, <clears throat> Atari 2600 ports and that I think that's going to be up there. <laughs> so, anyway. Let's go. <sighs> but I'm I'm waiting to get I want to, I'm waiting to get the, um, tur tur ugh, Turbo Arcade and, um, Elevator Agent before I do my reviews. I didn't 
did I? Oh, came out. Oh, I hesitated. I'm worried about that dumb watermelon. Oh man! Guys, I've been playing for an hour and I hit over a hundred thousand. <laughs> Mike's Gaming Gala said that uh, John should change the sprites to dinosaurs so that the dinosaurs have escaped. <laughs> well, guys, I appreciate you being here. Thanks for showing up um thanks for stopping by john john champo of champ games the coder of uh zookeeper yeah we uh we appreciate you being here um we want to remind you guys of the games for this week's uh uh retro bliss 
uh, Ninja Contest. It is, they are Donkey Kong and Beam Rider. Get your high scores into me. I'll have a video up a little later today um, to remind you of the game. So thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time on Retro Bliss Gaming. Take care. Bye.